There's one. They're up here. Boy, that one was just... Almost didn't even see him until the last second. Oh yeah, not a bad size one either. <laughs> he came back. They rarely do that, but that one did. Come here, fish. That fish followed it out, and I, you know, I made a couple of token casts back at it because you rarely can get those fish to come back. And uh, yeah, that one decided to come back for us. And when you get them in the shallow water, man, they like to jump. That's a nice fish, not a not a huge one, but a nice metro muskie. He's got a little bit of spunk in him. Probably one more good, one more good burst. It looks like he's hooked pretty good. Fold them up for the camera here. It's a nice, pretty metro musky. 36, 37 inches, maybe, maybe a little bigger than that. You know, a lot of people don't like musky fishing in, in June near the opener. We're about a week and a half into the season here, and I absolutely love this time of year. The fish haven't seen baits. This fish is ready to go already. The fish haven't seen baits in a while. And uh, I'm gonna let this fish go. See, he's ready. One more. Fish haven't seen baits in a while and they're usually really aggressive. And uh, I, I just absolutely love this time of year. Jerk baits, can even get them on top water. There he goes. It's, uh, you know, it's a lot of fun. It's, it's, it's early June. Like I said, the fish have not been pressured too much you know the, the week the season opened a week ago and you get a good cloudy day like this you can come out I'm, I'm more or less throwing a topwater bait it's a it's a viper jerk bait but uh, it stays right on top and uh, the side to side baits this year this time of year can be dynamite and once again uh, you know by going really shallow the water is going to be really warm up there and you're going to run into some more active fish so I'm going to replace the hook on this one and get back out there and see if we can't get another one. <laughs> 